हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू ऑनलाइन क्लास ऑफ मोदी पब्लिक स्कूल टूडे वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग चैप्टर नंबर फाइव डेसिमल्स पार्ट सेवन एंड टूडेज टॉपिक विल बी वर्ड प्रॉब्लम्स बेस्ड ऑन डेसिमल्स लेट इस स्टार्ट दिस इज पेज नंबर फिफ्टी थ्री ऑफ योर मैथ्स बुक एंड द क्वेश्चन इज इफ दस The sum of two decimal numbers is thirty six point nine five. If one decimal number is eighteen point two six, find the other number. Okay, so here it is given that sum of two decimal number is thirty six point nine five, and one of the decimal numbers is eighteen point two six. So to find out the other number, we have to subtract the smaller number from the greater one. Okay, so let us solve. Here, we will first write sum of two decimal numbers equals to thirty six point nine five. Then we will write one. Of the decimal number is equals to eighteen point two six. So the other number, the other number, will be. Thirty six point nine five minus eighteen point two six. Clear? Eighteen point two six. Now let us perform the subtraction part. Okay? हम यहाँ हमने यहाँ पे स्टेटमेंट्स फॉर्म कर लिए हैं हमने लिख दिया है कि दो डेसिमल नंबर्स का जो सम है वो thirty six point nine five है. अगर एक डेसिमल नंबर 18.26 है तो अदर डेसिमल नंबर क्या हो जाएगा 36.95 माइनस 18.26 लेट अस सब्ट्रैक्ट सिक्स कैन नॉट बी सब्ट्रैक्टेड फ्रॉम फाइव सो वी हैव टू टेक अ बोरो ठीक है नाउ 15 माइनस सिक्स इज नाइन नाउ एट माइनस टू व्हाट एट माइनस टू इज इट इज सिक्स नाउ विल कॉपी डाउन द डेसीमल नंबर Now we have to subtract eight from six. We all know that eight cannot be subtracted from six because eight is greater than six. So we have to take bar over here. Now sixteen minus eight is eight, and two minus one is one. So our answer is eighteen point six nine. Okay. So here, if the decimal two decimal. Two decimal numbers sum is thirty six point nine five. One of the number is eighteen point two six. So the other number is eighteen point six nine. Now the next question is how much should be subtracted from sixteen to get eight point nine six? This is question number seven. So to get eight point nine six, what must be subtracted from sixteen? To get its answer, we have to subtract eight point nine six from sixteen. Okay, let us start. Okay, so the required number will be sixteen point zero zero minus eight point nine six. Why I have written it sixteen point zero zero? Because here we have got two decimal places. Okay, so this will be subtracted out of sixteen. Let us start subtracting. Here. We cannot subtract six from zero. We have to take borrow, but this number is again a zero. So here we will take borrow from it. Now it is ten, and it will remain nine and ten. Now ten minus six is four. Nine minus nine is zero. Eight cannot be subtracted from five. So we it will be considered as fifteen. Okay, we will take. Borrow, then it will become fifty. We need not to write it like this, but here I am just explaining you. That's why I have written fifteen minus eight is seven. So our answer is seven point zero four. 
so the required number is 7.04 okay so the next problem is question number 8 and the question is find the sum of 8.96 and 3.854 now subtract 0.896 from the sum so first of all we have to add these numbers as sum is being asked sum means the result of addition so we here we have to add it but you can see here it we have only two decimal places and here we have got three decimal places so we will first convert them into like decimals so 8.960 i have added a zero here plus 3.8 854 so here 3.854 now let us start adding 0 plus 4 is 4 6 plus 5 is 11 one will be carry forward 8 plus 9 is 17 17 plus 8 one is 18 now 8 plus 1 is 9 9 plus 3 is 12 and here decimal point will be inserted so we have added these two number Now we have to subtract zero point eight nine six from this sum. So let us arrange them. Twelve point eight one four minus zero point eight nine six. Okay, let us start subtracting. Now six cannot be subtracted from four. We have to take four. Now it will become fourteen. Fourteen minus six is eight. Now, now nine cannot be subtracted from zero again. We will take borrow. Ten minus nine is one. Now again we will take borrow. Seventeen minus eight. Here we have to subtract eight from seventeen. So it will be nine. Then decimal point one minus zero is one and one as it is. So this is the answer. This is the required number. Now the next question is question number nine. A notebook cost forty five point two five rupees and a pencil cost three point five zero rupees. If Arjun buys four notebooks and three pencils, then find the total amount Arjun pays to buy the stationery. So here we will first write down the cost of a notebook. Okay, so cost of a notebook is forty five rupees. We have written twenty five rupees, twenty forty five rupees, twenty five paise. So cost of four notebooks will be forty five rupees, twenty five paise multiplied by four. We have to multiply it by four. Let us start multiplying. Four five za is twenty to carry forward. Four two za is eight. Eight plus two is ten. One carry forward. Four fives are twenty. Twenty plus one, twenty-one. To carry four times four is sixteen. Sixteen plus two is eighteen. Now here we will insert decimal point after two digits because there is a decimal point here also. So cost of four notebooks we have got one hundred and eighty-one rupees. Now cost of a pencil is three rupees fifty paise. So cost of three pencils will be three rupees fifty paise multiplied by three. So let us start multiplying. Three into zero is zero. Three five is fifteen. One carried. Three three is nine plus one is ten. So here we have got decimal after two digits. So here also we will insert a decimal point after two digits. Now the we have to find out the total amount which Arjun has paid to the state for to the uh, shopkeeper. So let us first let us. Add the amount which is given for the notebooks and for the pencils. So here we will write total total amount paid by Arjun. Now we will add one hundred and eighty one point zero zero and ten rupees fifty paise. Let us add zero plus zero is zero, zero plus five is five, one plus zero is one, eight plus one is nine, and one. So the total amount 
पेड बाय अर्जुन इज वन हंड्रेड नाइन्टी वन रुपीज फिफ्टी पैसे सो इन टू डेज क्लास वी हैव डिस्कस्ड सम ऑफ द वर्ड प्रॉब्लम विच वर गिवन एन आर मैथ्स बुक ओके दैट्स ऑल फॉर टू डेज क्लास थैंक यू सो मच